Hi all. Yeah, today uh, we can we can uh, see about the license. License means normally Siemens uh, having license for the, all the softwares like uh, PLC. If you're using PLC engineering uh, development software or maybe HMI developing software for the SCADA developing software on the runtime also having the uh, licenses. So normally you have to when you buy the license, they will give a license key or some kind of a downloadable. Uh, uh, key so you have to uh, use that key to activate your software uh, maybe uh, I can show you how today how we can uh, activate the license in the offline so maybe we can start uh, now uh, normally uh, if you install the software right any software kind of Siemens software like a uh, semantic manager or a TIA uh, TI in version 13 14 15 or even though in HMI it will default uh, it will uh, installed with uh, installed automation license manager that is for the license Siemens license. I can just open that one so you will get okay. This is Siemens automation license manager. Just open it. Actually, the when you want to uh, some kind of change your file, change your no, not file, change your license or you want to move that things, then you have to open that uh, file for the license. Actually, this is the uh, file for the license. Okay, if you want to transfer, if you want to. Uh, enable it uh, not not means enable just you want to transfer the license in the C so it will be enabled okay normally uh, they will give a, like here I mean just plug the, the USB drive you named like a license key it's having the three license here okay uh, normally uh, the the license uh, we will purchase it right they will give this kind of thing we need to transfer this license to our C drive okay normally if you want to uh, use in a dongle also you can use it but while you unpack the license key right it will not uh, it will not your software will not open actually in this in the system it should be available okay once it's available in your uh, in your dongle or in the, your C drive then it will it will uh, not create any issue in the software you can open it you can just open and open, edit everything you can possible but if you if you transfer to some other places like uh, uh, for another computer or something this computer will not work actually the license they call it as a floating license the floating license means it's kind of a license you can able to move it cannot fixed in the particular one system okay if you want to if you have an example you have a three computers okay now all three computers you, you just uh, install the three softwares okay uh, like a TIA portal TI version 15 okay then you install the all the three then uh, do you have a uh, purchased only one version okay but uh, if you want to use right you can use it how okay first you just install the uh, maybe you just plug the uh, license and transfer to the first system once you have opened that software it will open you can create a program you just to download the thing everything you can do okay just uh, uh, transfer back to the license key again then unpack the uh, USB drive then plug the second software and transfer the key or maybe you just plug it and use it it means you can cut paste the thing okay example if you are using in one single computer if you are if you cut the license key license file then paste it in another area it means you cannot copy you cannot uh, get another copy of the thing it will be, will be available in the only one places okay among the three computers so it's kind of a, they call it as a floating license okay once the license you have installed it will be lifelong for that particular version Okay, that's just mentioned it won't be available for the particular version you have purchased right if they have upgraded the version if you are in uh, you, this license will not work you have to update the license it means you have to purchase the specific update for the license example if you are uh, purchased the uh, v13 okay uh, you have license but right now Siemens having v15 uh, you have installed the v15 it will not work you have to purchase a uh, upgrade license 13 to 15 that license you have to purchase so similar thing it will work okay now we can I can show you how we can transfer license okay example in the license okay this is a license example this is a license for the TR 13 basic okay I'm just right click right click this particular license and transfer it will, it will ask for the which drive you want to transfer okay just I'm using C if you press ok right it will be disappear from here and you will get it from the C drive okay I'm just showing it's it, it's showing right transfer it's transferred it's it's moved from here and you can yeah it's here okay you can check just check okay 
here it it's used it means it's okay license key is okay these and all are uh, it, it's it's having it now right now it's not used okay so if you want to change again uh, you want to change right you want to transfer just right click where you want just to transfer i'm just to uh, again uh, transfer back to the license key it means the usb stick okay now it's 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 away from here and it's here okay example you want to move all the three licenses okay example some some kind of software you put it together it will come as a, maybe a single key or maybe something okay sorry I'm doing one by one. Okay, it means it is this is used somewhere else. So I think we cannot move here. We can. Okay, this is okay. Check. This is used. Transfer. Okay, it means. You, while you transferring it, if it's uh, not um, transferring it, it's some kind of it, it will be in a user state just to update or uh, check it will be a, coming to the normal state then just to, to the transfer okay all right now i have done the, all the three so right now i don't have in the usb stick any licenses but i'm, I'm having inside the my c drive okay whatever what happened if okay if, if something goes wrong you have a uh, OS is corrupted some kind of issues happen right you just uh, climb the say, you, can, you can climb this license from to Siemens if you have they will they will issue the one certificate okay license key certificate license certificate through the license certificate you just raise a request I have my uh, my computer is OS is corrupted I, I just lost my license so they will uh, they will check it and verify it some kind of verification with, uh, with you then uh, they will provide a new license so like uh, if you have uh, the license certificate you, it's available just keep it with you kept with you always that license number uh, license certificate having some number then they will uh, they will give back or again maybe if you are something happened your system OS corrupted some kind of things happened uh, so they will they will give again the things okay just uh, keep it safe the license certificate always okay uh, this is the license licenses and uh, offline transfer we call it is offline transfer there is another one is called uh, off online okay right now i don't have any siemens account right now with me so if uh, if i am having the siemens account or some kind of thing it's here it will it will uh, it will actually here right you can just log in it and once while you purchase the thing you can it will be available to transfer you just to transfer to here to your drive okay Right now I don't have the access so uh, access mean I don't have any software to, to purchase the thing so I don't have the particular uh, things now so maybe while uh, I'm purchasing I will show the demo right now this is the offline transfer if you have any uh, kind of uh, doubts just uh, ping me in the command section I will uh, try to answer it thank you guys bye bye have a, have a good day